Hi, welcome back to the channel. This is my Ferguson 23C powered uh, MF35. These tractors were notorious for not starting, and especially notorious for not starting in cold weather. They had a series type uh, glow plug system in them. So if one glow plug burned out, they would not start. They also had a resistor in the series to lower the voltage of the glow plugs. And this resistor would actually glow red, burning off a lot of power. A lot of power needs to start. So what I found from Turner Engineering in the UK is a set of glow plugs I put in it this summer. Well, I figured I'd pick today because it's obviously a cold winter day, December 1st, 2020. This is our second snowfall of the season. It's not too bad out. It's about 30 degrees probably, so it's not real terrible. And uh, I'm going to see how it starts. So I've got a broken wire here. Hopefully the battery's got some charge in it. It's a broken starter wire. Got the fuel on. I'll uh, power the glow plugs. Of course, this is an old tractor. I almost, I rarely change oil in it. Probably once since I've had it. I need to just oil chain it. And I'll hold the glow plug on here. I, uh, I actually broke the, lost the wire for the uh, starter here because it's my cab. See how notoriously cold blooded the tractor is. Yep. Okay, let's try it again. So hold the glow plug controller on. I've just got a toggle switch connected to it. No relay, no uh, no solenoids. And then fire it up. I actually just saw on the key that my uh, my key says Lucas on it. So of course the old series system glow plugs were Lucas. And why they would put them in a series is beyond me. Again, I'm holding the glow plugs on. So I kicked up the RPMs to uh, get it to uh, continue running. But hey, I think this is a good proven point that this whole tractor will actually run with the glow plugs. Now, 2025, 20, I got a feeling it probably would run. Now, if it gets really bad, you might have to throw a little uh, WD-40 in it. But it's a great little tractor. 